Welcome to another upgradable SSD installation guide. Today we're putting an SSD in a Satellite P850. We've already cloned the drive with a Cronus that comes with the SSD. I like to have a short black before a uh, installation. I'm drinking Nespresso. What's your uh, favorite coffee? Comments below. Okay, you're gonna have to find the compartment. You'll need a small Phillips head screwdriver, just like that one. There's one screw that holds in the um, compartment that has the RAM and the hard drive and you'll just need to loosen it up. It doesn't come out, but you'll then need a spludger or a plastic knife. This one, again, like the screwdriver, comes in the newer tech five-piece toolkit that we sell. It's on the website. Look it up. Now, if you just run that knife or that spludger around, that it should just force the clips off and once that happens there you go the lid comes off the RAM and the SSD are right there now there's nothing really holding in that SSD it's got a tab pull it it just comes out and it has this plastic metal sleeve on it that's attached by screws down the side and the coffee will be kicking in now going a lot faster just take those screws off and take that sleeve off and I like to put it on the new SSD it just makes putting the SSD in and out a lot easier so get the SSD it's a crucial SSD that's one we recommend put that on the sleeve just make sure that the connection lines up with how it goes into the notebook so I always just check to make sure is that going in right? Yep, I've got it on the right way. And then put the screws on. Now, like I said, we've already cloned the SSD. So it's got the operating system and everything on it. We used a Cronus. Uh, it comes with the SSD, comes with our SSD kits. And you'll see the SSD just is the same size, just pops straight in. There you go, done. All we need to do is put on the lid. Just put the one end in one edge in first and then push it down and those clips will reattach and that's it it's that easy tighten up that one screw and you're good to go because it already has the clone on the SSD um, turn it over and power it up and you're done super fast SSD this one booted in 10 seconds so it's very worth it if you're after an SSD or any parts, please look us up online. We're upgradable. Thanks for watching.